everybody, how are you? Today's video is an automation request. Uh, here's a comment from a user requesting that I demonstrate an automation of folder uh, structure creation with the subfolders in the primary folder having um, the name of the main folder in the title. So something like uh, my project and then you know inside my project which is the main folder having um, a my project images, my project uh, video and my project thumbnails for, for example. So um, first, I'm gonna uh, show you the Apple script, and then we're gonna implement the Apple script, and then at the end, I'll show you how to um, create an application using Automator to um, be able to trigger the uh, that folder creation automation whenever you want me to. All right, so let's get started. First, we're going to um, open uh, Apple Script. I'm going to open a brand new document. And then I do have this Apple script um, stored in a macro. And if I were to type it, it would actually take forever to uh, get through this video. So here is the macro. And then we'll compile it. So it'll give the new folder um, a project name after you're asked, and the uh, sub folder names is going to be photos, footage, thumbnails, and tags. I don't know why I wanted tags in there, but I do. It was just something to um, put in. I couldn't think of another folder name. So, and now it's going to create a, um, give you a dialog box that says enter project name. And then you um, would take the result and then hit <clears throat> OK. And then um, then here choose choose folder with a prompt. So it also asks you uh, where you want to save the folder. And then, uh, and you go through that process, and you select a folder location. And when I run the script, you'll see that I will choose a desktop folder location. And then, um, yeah. And then, if it, if you get an error, you'll get an option to cancel. Um, and it's all in a dialog box. But hopefully, we won't run into this section here. All right. So this is the Apple script. And I will have it in linked at the in the description of this video. But this is the Apple script. Let's try running it. So enter project name. Let's say my project 
or my video project. And I hit OK. And then now you get to choose where you want to save this primary folder. So I'm going to say desktop and hit choose and here it has created the um, folder and let's open this folder see what's in it all right so you have um, four folders here you have my video project tags, my video project um, uh, thumbnails, my video project footage, and photos. And there you have it. Um, and it says, uh, then enter. Pro project this is where this comes from you so this part here is your what you entered as my video and the defaults which is which are um, tags thumbnails footage and photos they come from here and the project folder which is um, what we have here. So you entered the name, but it added project folder. And that is how you create a folder structure using AppleScript. Now, to create a application we would uh, hit automator go to automator there it is automator and say new project And we're going to be sure to select application, and then choose. Now we have one action here. We're going to type that we're going to add to this. We're going to type Apple Script. Yes, I have a text expander snippet that um, will type Apple Script for me. Um, that's pretty easy to figure out. I will uh, make a video on another video on text expander snippets if you comment down below. But anyway, this is the action. So I would run the this um, delete this text here. And then I'm going to copy this text. And compile it by hitting the hammer symbol right here. And then all you do is save it. Give it a name and you save it in um, your applications folder. And then, once you save it in the Applications folder, I'm not going to save this because I already have this project saved in my Applications folder. So I'm going to close this. And I'm going to say Delete. But I will show you that I do have it here in my um, Applications folder, and it's right here. I called it Folder Structure. And when I click on it, 
I get the same thing that you all saw in the, towards the beginning of this video. Well, guys, I hope you, uh, I hope you, uh, like this video, and I hope that, um, that Harvish, uh, enjoyed this, uh, video as well, and I'm sorry if I mispronounced your name, um, but I hope this is bene beneficial to you. Please, um, like, subscribe, and comment on my video. It really helps out my channel. And I will see you all in the next video.